the bottom of Lake Missoula had what appeared to be lake bottom sediments. Fair enough. There was a point where the geological community sent signals to Bretts that they were ready to give his flood theory a fair hearing. So they invited him to Washington to give a talk to this select group of elite geologists. Bretts did not really know about the existence of this giant lake. J.T. Pardee leans over to his colleague sitting next to him and whispers, I know where Bretts' flood came from. That was a turning point. Still took another 10 or 20 years and younger geologists coming up to the profession that were more open-minded and it took really up until 1969. I think there was a major paper published with Bretz as a lead author but a bunch of other geologists and it was like the confirmation, the final confirmation that yes, a majority of us realize now that Bretz's floods are real.